Today is a day that I've been looking forward to. Today is my day off. So after weeks of working on the patents and making sure that everything is sound with Dan and the finances and cleaning up after Kenny, I'm finally ready to not worry about anything or anyone. What are your plans for today? Oh, you know, probably sit around and play some Xbox. Maybe invite the neighbors over for a party later. Wait, what? I needed to figure out a way to get Kenny out of the house. So I gave him 40 bucks and told him to do whatever he wanted with it. Best 40 bucks I ever spent. Well, I guess that Eric really wanted me out of the house today because uh, look what that guy gave me. 40 buckaroos. Now I have to responsibly invest this into something where I can reach a net profit margin of a lot of money in the long run. Uh, I'm hungry. Hey, uh, Jerry. What's hey, Dan. Hey. Good. Um, it, everything's everything's swell. It's uh, it's all working out. We got a, a lot of shots lined up. Um, you know, I I really like the subject matter. It seems uh, seems like it's gonna get, make some people think. You know what I mean? Good, good. Making people think is a good thing, Dan. I've always said that. I've always said that. Kenny's gone, so I guess I can clean up around here. No, that's Varl. Varl? Yeah, he's a good guy. Is he Swedish? Uh, I couldn't say. Uh, some Nordic of some kind. Yeah, Nordic. That sounds right to me. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, you know, we got a nice team, uh, the, the communication is great, and, um, you know, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Tell so, me again, what, what, what's this documentary about? It's a new product. It's going to revolutionize the way people think about moving boxes. All right. Uh, but it's, it's, it's interesting to, you know, letting the people see exactly how to, you know, move forward with an idea and get into the marketplace. Um, it should really show some people. Yeah. Now, did you say moving boxes like the animals? One. Uh, that's all you need. Kenny! Uh, what are you doing? Hey, Nick. Did you get a 
Get away from the wolves. I... What? So, it's all working out. It, we're good to all go. Right. Yep. It's good to be good to go. I've always said that, too. It's good to be, it's good, to be good to go. It's good to be good to go, man. You got it, brother. All right, well, uh, I'm going to... I'm gonna see if I can climb in this McDonald's strip of the bathroom window or something. I, and I'll talk to you later, okay? All right, buddy. Yeah, well, I got you here. I'd, I'd love oh, to actually. Oh, you know what? There's a story that I've been meaning to tell you for like five years now. I just haven't seen you. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I was hanging out with Larry. You remember Larry? That bald guy. Well, then you're not really gonna appreciate the story. So, yeah, it'd be great to talk to you, actually. I've got some uh, things. Do you think that that is a, a chestnut tree? I don't. Or is it, it might be a beech tree. I don't Not know. an actual beech. Do you think that these gray squirrels just go around and plant nuts and then the trees just sprout up? I I was really trying to to talk to you about something. It's rather important. Uh -huh. So if You know what's important is I just replaced the tires on my car, and I don't think I put any air Kenny, in Kenny, would you listen to me? All right, it's about Dan, oh. and I want to talk to you about it. So would you just, all right? Oh, okay. Shut up. Oh, no, okay. Shut up. Finally got to talk to Kenny about what I wanted to talk to him about. Yeah, so I'm going to get my revenge on Dan. And uh, I kindly explained to Kenny the details of that. And uh, he agreed to help me out. He's aware of Dan's wrongdoings, and we got to put him in his right place. So that's that. That's what needs to happen. I miss Kenny. I'm calling him. So I just happened to be walking through the park and I saw this flyer. Tell me that isn't the best idea ever. $30 to see the world. I'm gonna take advantage of that. 